What is that, dude? What's up? You got the other old style cutter with you? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and try it out. <laughs> what kind of rig is that? <laughs> uh, well, the slate looks really good. Barry, we don't have a water bottle with some water in it, do we? Close cut. That is looking really good. And all those. Is that lime dust or what is the white? It's like lime dust or what is that it, 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 on there? It's like a mud and stuff like that, you know? Yeah, it'll come off. The, yeah, it'll come off. That's what I got easy too, you know? Yeah, keep, keep it, straight. it straight. Yeah, keep it laid flat. That's good. Oh boy. Oh yeah, man. Look. Oh, that is gonna look good. It's almost like we need to take the pressure washer, just lightly go over the whole thing. That's good. I just wanted to show them what pe show people what it's gonna look like after it's all clean. Oh, yeah, looking down wow. It's gonna look really good. This little segment is for Wrangler Star. <laughs> uh, I noticed he had a little bit of a rant video the other day talking about, you know, where people had gotten onto him about talking about old style tools. Well, this is a very good example of where new style doesn't work as good as old style. This, this, this type of shear works really good on fiber cement siding where it won't crack it, but we keep having it break the, the slate. So we've actually gone back to using the old style cutter. Been doing it that way for a long time, right, Paco? Oh yeah, <laughs> hundreds of years. Easy, easy. <laughs> what we're gonna do? At the bottom of the windows is, for, and that's why the trim is left off. We're notching it out so that it will cover up the last row of screws. So all the fasteners will be hidden. It's gonna look nice. We've got our roof basically done. There's some trim pieces that we lack, but and cleaning it, got a bunch of dust and dirt on it from installing, but it's looking good. I kind of wanted to just do, I felt like a doing a support video for Wrangler Star. Um, he seemed kind of down in his in the last video, his rant, and, and I know he's just venting, but he, what, he, what he, the intent of his video was correct. There are many times that we use tools, older style tools, well, just something as simple as a screwdriver, right, Barrett? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's it's not always. Uh, it's sometimes just simpler just to grab a uh, you know a, a handheld screwdriver instead of going and getting a cordless drill, you know, and putting a bit in it. Um, so I mean, there's many examples of, of for those of us that are in the industry that there are more than really we can even think of. Uh, many occasions we use simple older style tools and I don't know it's a it's hard to describe the feeling of I mean I've, I've been doing this since 1978 it's a long time I'm an old man but um, it's hard to describe how 
Um, dang it. I was talking about Wrangler Star, and um, it's oh, I know what I was what I was trying to get across was the fact that you know people who don't do this every day. Um, I don't know. It it this, I guess this is true in any industry. People watch videos and they they want it. I think they they want to contribute, but they don't necessarily know how. Sometimes they instead of just trying to be entertained and just say saying you know hey cool cool video or that's what I always try to do. I mean. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I wouldn't try to go on Cody's videos and tell him how to do something. I just think that's tacky or telling that, tell him that, uh, you know, he needs to be using this, this, uh, tool or that tool, or why aren't you doing this? There's just, you know, there's enough of that on YouTube and that, that part of it takes all the fun out of it for me. And, uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's what he's talking about. So anyway, <laughs> uh, there are many many examples and uh we understand you wrangler star and and appreciate what you're doing and i've always always liked your videos i don't always comment on, th on them again because I, I just you know i don't want to catch myself you know giving you industry input what the heck is that Barrett, you dog anyway uh just a little quick little support video for Angler Star and uh, another few examples of uh, old style tools. Thanks for watching guys. Nice.